Howdy. Uh, today we're going to build a broadband absorber panel. We're going to take a couple of pieces of Owens Corning OC703 compressed fiberglass, two inches thick, four feet by two feet. We're going to put the two of them together to make one four inch panel. Wrap it up in burlap to keep the fiberglass in, make it easier to handle. And uh, we'll have one panel to improve the sound in our room. This piece of Owen Corning over here, this one, has an FSK coating, um, aluminum foil. I don't know, not very thick. It's some kind of waffle pattern in it. Um, I am told that that improves the base uh, trapping of the panels made with with one piece of FSK. So we're mating that FSK panel with a non-FSK panel. So I put the FSK side down first, and now the other panel on top of it. These things are not precision engineered. It's not like they're machined to be precise. It's kind of a fabric of sorts, so it's, it moves around, gets squished in transit. So we just kind of line them up. Now, you probably make it easier to handle them as I'm working with them if I go ahead and glue them together. So we'll shake it up real good, lift that up, just give it a shot, boom! Drop it back on there. Do a little shot. Drop it back down. Now you may know somebody. You may be an upholsterer yourself. You may know somebody who knows about upholstery. If you know anybody who knows anything, they can probably tell you a better way to do this than the way I do it. Because I'm just making this up as I go along. But, let's put a shot of this on the end, and a little on the fabric. Notice I'm using a tabletop that I don't care about. Uh, another shot over here, and some on the fabric. So, I'm going to take it over the top, cut it loose, and then, Pull it up and start trying to get it to attach here. I'm rubbing the two tacky surfaces together. Now I'll do the same thing at the other end. Okay, so let's do it again. And then we'll shoot our And we'll do the same over here. Probably a lot more glue than I need, right? One of the things is, I never get to make enough of these to get really good at it. I make five or ten at a time and forget what I learned by the next time. But. Smooth it out pretty good. So, that's not terrible. It's not good, but it's not terrible. So this is easy, isn't it? Now, you can build frames and all kinds of cool very attractive, sophisticated uh, kinds of panels. And if they have to go in the living room, you should probably do that. So, shoot in here.
Then we'll fold it in like this and fold it down like this. So there's the first step in the wrap. And we just keep doing that around. So now this is a good time to use the, the rubber gloves the, because uh, we might be smearing down some hot glue. It's a lot more fun with gloves on. Let's see if we can get us some glue over here. Yep, coming out. Uh, in other uh, experiments, it'll go right through the first layer and bond with the second layer and seal down those pesky little burlap threads. This burlap is cheap and breathable and real organic looking if you like that sort of thing or care. Mainly it's cheap. But it's of course raggy and stretchy. And you may be willing to spend a little more to have a fabric that works better, easier. But for now, there's a one. OC703 broadband absorber sound control panel.